Hello, my name is Jim Delphon, and behind the camera is my partner, Matt Willett. Together we're going to be making a game called Battle Tanks. This is going to be a version of the popular turn-based game where the goal is to destroy the opponent. The game will have a simple one-button interface to play and will allow for one or two players. Here's a demo of what the game could look like. Alright, here we have the control interface for our game, a prototype of it. We have over here an angle indicator determines the angle the projectile will be shot with and a power box here which determines the power it is shot at. To control it you simply press the button and hold it down. It will swing through the angle first when it hits one end bounces back. If you can continue holding it down when it gets to the very bottom it will start swinging back up. It continues like this bouncing back and forth until you release the button that locks it in. Once the angle is locked in, control now switches to the power bar. Press down the button and hold it, same way you did with the angle indicator. When it hits the end, it will bounce back. Just like with the angle indicator, it bounces back off the bottom as well. We'll continue to go back and forth as long as you hold down the button. Once your settings have been decided, your animation of that shot will then happen right above. So here we have a player on the right hand side shot at an angle of 45 degrees at 75 percent power. The projectile travels a little ways and hits a building. You get a small explosion when you hit a building, but it doesn't continue and you won't hit your mark. On the other side we have the player set to 80 degrees and shot at 75 percent as well and as the projectile travels over the buildings and hits the other player you get a much bigger explosion and the other player is defeated